And yesterday was the first full day of sunshine. Although the storms may be over, you could still find damage around our area. From Stockton to the Bay Area, destruction could be seen all around, and no other place was more prevalent than in the city of Sacramento. ABC 10's Marques Allen in Sacramento's Land Park area this morning with a look at the cleanup effort that's been going on for several days. And Mark, I think what you're going to tell us is it's going to be a while before they get this thing uh, back to where it used to be. Yeah, well, if you're the one that pointed this out to us, take a look. This is a closed road I'm on right now. They got to get all of this out of the way. It's going to take a while, but they are doing everything they can nonstop to do so. Take a look. Around the clock, workers taking advantage of the sunny day to remove the destruction. Century-old fallen trees, many donated by Sacramento pioneer William Land himself, literally down in every direction for as far as the eye can see. For Bob Klein, who's been working this golf course for decades, it's not the first time he's seen this, but it is the worst. Well, we had another uh, pretty good event where there were a lot of trees lost, but Nothing like this. We just had so much rain and so much wind that it uh, put it in a class of its own. The most damage is near William Land Golf Course, which, by the way, is already up and running again. Joe Schwartzbein was first on the scene. It was just a mess. It looked like a bomb had gone off. Several bombs had gone off. I caught up with the crew supervisor, Mohammed, this brief interview, the first break he's had in a long time. Today is a beautiful day. I can't imagine you're having to do all this even when it's still coming down. Yes, we were here whole last week and uh, cutting all these trees and moving them and focus is like safety hazards first and then uh, whatever is on ground, pick it up. And In your life, have you ever seen it this bad? No, this is the worst I've seen, uh, especially at uh, Land Park here. Hey, and shout out to Muhammad and everyone that's helping to get Sacramento back to normal, get it cleaned up, and like he said, safety first. And by that, he means take a look around. All you have to do is walk through Land Park. There are trees that might not be so stable. They're identifying those and making sure that they get rid of them and clean up those that have already fallen down. And as he said, golf course, back open. I guess that was priority number two, <laughs> and it's running full service. Back to you. Yeah, it's interesting, Mark, in, in driving by there. I've never seen anything like that. And it's amazing, you know, it's like every sixth tree was down. And, and you think of all the storms we've had through the years. This one was just a crusher. Yeah, like they said, uh, obviously there was another incident a few years ago. This one, however, the biggest in its history and kind of sad when you think about it. Former Mayor William Land donated $250,000 yeah. at his death to create this park. And some of those original trees no longer with us. Yeah, Back hundreds here. of years old. Okay, Mark, thank you so much. And now's a great time to download our free ABC 10 app. You can track local conditions and have warnings sent straight to your phone.